Most people think that using electricity to heal is a recent innovation, but electricity was used in conjunction with acupuncture back in 1890. A little before this, 2000 years to be precise, batteries were discovered that researchers think may have been used for acupuncture and to anaesthetise skin prior to surgery. Flash forward to the 1920s, when a brilliant scientist called Royal Rife found that nasty viruses and bacteria could be quickly destroyed if the correct frequency and application method was used. To this day, we are struggling to repeat his success. More recently, Dr. Holder Clark developed simpler and cheaper methods of applying frequencies to the body. She wrote the book The Cure of All Diseases and several other titles. Her research was focused on low technology solutions to often very serious illnesses. Dr. Clark believed that parasites are destroyed if a weak pulsing DC is applied, so she developed the zapper. These zappers typically run off 9 volts and use primitive electronics. They are safe because the amount of current that passes the body is low and Dr. Clark recommends a maximum treatment time of 7 minutes. The pulsing DC frequency is not very important. Many people believe that zappers should run at 15 Hz. Others argue that higher frequencies of around 33 kilohertz are more effective. Good quality zappers often have a selection of frequencies to choose from. Spooky can be very easily turned into an advanced zapper. The waveform is more effective than a simple pulsed DC, and we have included it into our presets. You can directly run the Zapper BY preset in Spooky too. For greater safety, we recommend using the Colorado Silver port of Spooky Boost. A safety resistor limits the current to very safe levels. My personal view is that zappers have limited effectiveness. Dr. Clark died in 2009 from cancer. Zappers may work for many medical conditions, but they should be used in conjunction with several other protocols and lifestyle changes. The future of electrical healing lies in the past. Plasma.